Yes, sir. It's your boy B Hayes. We're back with another one, guys. So AMC, first time ever, guys. Let's go ahead and take a look at it, see what's going on. We know AMC is trying to be very, very meticulous and smart about the decisions that they make from here going forward. Being for the fact that Adam Aaron might got a bad investment under his hand with the gold mining company, as we know, guys, it's trading at sixty in the in the cents. It need to be over one dollar to reach Nasdaq compliance. It has until. 180 days around April of next year in order to reach that minimum. And if it don't, then it's going to be delisted. It'll still have another chance to do a reverse stock split in order to save itself. But if that don't work, it's going to be over with for that company, guys. And that's going to be a bad 20 plus million dollar deal from AMC, guys. So let's go ahead and take a look at it. We know that it's going to be very smart and meticulous with the way they move from here going forward, being for the fact they already got saved by one bill, and that bill was being that we know their peers had went bankrupt and filed bankruptcy. We know these multi-billion dollar industries or multi-million dollar companies, whenever they file bankrupt, that doesn't necessarily mean they flat broke. It just means they're not making the profits in order to sustain that business. You know, the profit, the revenue, profit margins is not making sense. So anyways, let's go ahead and take a look at it, guys. So Netflix to bring Knives Out sequel to AMC and other theaters a month before screaming. So uh, AMC will release a one-week Thanksgiving theoretical sneak preview of a, its highly anticipated movie, Glass Onion, a Knives Out mystery. So what happened? After it's screening... At the Toronto International Film Festival, Netflix had decided to release the sequel to the 2019 Daniel Craig star Knives Out in Theaters before unveiling it to its subscribers on December 23rd. It will be the first ever Netflix film to debut across all three major U.S. theoretical chains, AMC, Theater, Regal, and Cinemark. So guys, this is great news. I have been, Adam Aaron had tweeted, I have been working for four years to be able to say this. Today we announced our first ever showing of a Netflix movie at AMC in the U.S. and in Europe. The Knives Out sequel stars Daniel Craig. Success here could lead to more Netflix movies at AMC, guys. So this is great news for AMC, guys. As we know, AMC is back all the way back down full 360 back to its original prices that five six dollar range is definitely in that buy zone buy territory guys is not much more that could actually happen to amc from here but some upside potential so you already know what to do add your boy on instagram i love y'all we out and god bless you